Hi everyone, um, another episode of our series Hashtag She Can. Today I'm talking about a woman in our microfinance program. Her name is Tigist Neger. Tigist is a mother of four. She has four daughters. She lives on the top of Entoto, which is one of the mountains around Addis Ababa. It's a beautiful area. Each time we have to visit people there, we absolutely love it. You drive up, it's very green, it has beautiful air. Um, so when we went to visit her last, we were really, really proud of this um, Tigist because she has joined our program a long time ago. So right when we started, she was one of the first women. And she started because she simply couldn't provide for her family. She has four daughters and, and other um, family members living with her up there in Nontoto. And um, she's a really gregarious woman. She's lots of fun. And so she was so um, excited each time we went to see her to tell us all the new things that she invested in. So she started making a sort of bar in her front yard. And front yard sounds quite glamorous. It's really just the front of her house where she set up some chairs and she made a snack called Tella. That's how she started. So the first round of loans, she in invested into that. And then over the years, she kept investing more and more money to make this into a really um, good bar. And lots of people stopped by all the time and she became very successful doing this. And also she not only was successful in doing it herself, but she had her daughters helping her and they went to school obviously, but when they were off school, she, um, she um, also included other women from her neighborhood who um, one was brewing the beer for the bar and one was doing other food items. So they really have become, have come together as a community of women um, running a very successful bar in that area of Addis Ababa over the many years and so if we ask her now she says that the great thing about the uh, about the microfinance program was the training um, so she learned all the important things to run a successful business you know how do you do a little market analysis to understand what works in your area um, conversations with our team on what are you good at? You know, she's very good at chatting. She's quite funny, so she's perfect to run something like that. Uh, she really learned how to bookkeep, how to budget for things, um, how to um, invest wisely. You know, she ran, did certain snacks and then she didn't have enough money to really invest in many more food things. So she got other women from her neighborhood to also join the program and, and, and service different areas of what she needed. So she was very intelligent in doing that. Um, her daughters are now all graduating from school, even from university. So she really has uh, been an incredible role model, not only to her daughters, but to her daughter's friends, to the women in her neighborhood and together they have been feeding their local economy which is the most important thing um, training a woman giving her access to um, credit and and giving her a bank account is feeding the local economy and so that is really good for business of a country thank you so much for listening again i realize this is not perfect conditions we have uh you know um here in the countryside we have tractors driving past the sound i'm sure is not always perfect i'm not a journalist so we do what we can but thank you so much for listening to our stories we're now looking for a new donor to raise a new fund with us so if you're interested please get in touch thank you